Y'all gotta watch this shit, man. This, what's up, YouTube? YouTube! Coming through this traffic, man. I had to beat it down through LA to miss the LA traffic, but shit. They beat. We got a little shit knocking. But, uh, hell, I'm, I mean, I'm like 40 miles south of LA. I had Riverside, California. But, uh, traffic is still nasty and it's uh it's three o'clock you know what i mean it's three o'clock it's not even five o'clock and i mean we ain't doing nothing uh-oh and then you got the cars like this and i got all this weight they quick to cut you off and ain't going nowhere in the back of the train you know what i mean see and, and it's one after the other quick for the cutoff quick for the cutoff and then fuck around and mind you, this is a hill right here. This is an incline. And I gotta keep watching either side because they, they quick to cut you off. They do that jolly. Sell me Viagra, man. Ah. Watch this car. He coming over. He coming over. Okay. He gonna keep going all the way. Stupid ass. I mean, it, people don't think out here, man. But you got as a truck driver, you got to think for all of them. Especially with this many lanes, you really got to see that. See how quick he cut. No signal lights are given or nothing. They just go cut in front of you. They go keep doing it. Over and over and over. But the minute you tap that shit, you would fall. This car right here to the right, gotta watch it. Never know what he gonna do. And I'm happy. So I gotta stay right here. I wouldn't walk be like, why wouldn't I go all the way to the right? No, you can't. Because people getting on and off the exit. That shit gonna jam you up. And you, you might end up getting an accident in that lane. So the best thing for you to do is stay in this lane right here. Because it's the only two lanes you can ride in. But you got to stay in this one. And be seeing as how I'm so heavy. I'm staying back from our team because I know these people cutting in and out. So you know they're cutting in and out. You don't ride up tight like that. But then you're going to have an accident. You're going to jack your shit off. You got to pay attention out here to what's going on. These four-wheelers, always they don't understand what's going on with your tractor. Nor do they care. All they're thinking about is I got to get over here. I got to get over there. They're not thinking how much weight this is. They're not thinking that we can't stop these tractors on a dime. They don't care. They're thinking about what they got to get done. Their agenda. That's why so many of them get rolled up. But you have to think for them. And if you're not prepared to do that, well, you shouldn't be out here. This isn't the place for you. So you're not holding your hands out here. You got to be able to hold the four-wheelers hand. You got to hold their hand. They don't know what they doing. If you got some truck drivers, this is stupid. Now see another thing, like I hate situations like this, like Martin, see how high his trailer is? He's high just like me, he got that high box. Well, I can't see nothing in front of him. So my visibility is dead and I'm heavy. So I have to stay back off Martin far enough to where I can kind of peep the other lanes around him. So if they start jamming up, they start breaking. I know Martin about to break. See what I'm saying? You gotta be aware of all that because I can't stop this vehicle quick. I need time and space to be able to bring this vehicle to a safe stop. You know, I laugh and joke, you know, shoot the shit, but I be into my job. I be into what I do because I just believe that me doing what I do, how I do, taking pride in it, doing it good and trying to do a better and better and better job, I believe that that's gonna lead to something better for me. Maybe not today, Maybe not tomorrow, but I'll leave it's going to. That's just the work ethic that I have. And anything I do, I try to put 100 into it. Even in my YouTube, I take time and try to put videos together, spend money, buy stuff to make your watching experience that much better. See that? Did you see that? I want y'all to see the foolishness that goes on every day. It's what we deal with. Every day. You got to be prepared. That's why you can't be distracted looking at yourself or none of the other foolishness. It's popping out here. You know what I mean? And they in and out of lanes, changing, doing all kinds of crazy things. So, we're going to speed y'all up a little bit. 
I'll let y'all ride or not. I don't know if we're going to a scale that's probably one of the worst scales in the country. Uh, it, 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 it's really a torture scale. Uh, I'm a little bit nervous about it. They always give people level ones, level twos, level threes, and fours. So we gonna get on down there and hopefully we can get through with none of that. And I'll get back at you. Yes, yes, yes. This is the batting scale, people. We go in, y'all. The batting scale. Uh, this is one of the most dangerous scales here on the planet. Okay, as far as the United States go, this is a training scale. And they usually give you the blues. But, your boy, I got the green light. So that means I ain't going up in there today. Somebody else gonna be the most victim today, but it won't be me. It won't be me. So we uh pass the scale. Here we go. I don't know if y'all can see it, but remember I told you about the banded scale coming into California? They got everything stopped. Look at the trucks over there. Look how long the line is. They want everything in there. Training scale. They own the bullshit. So if you're coming into Cali on the dime, you're down here in the bottom, you run across the bottom, and you're coming in on the dime, some of you already been through here, you know what it is through the band and scale. I'm just telling you, you've never been through here. The band and scale and band in California is a training facility. They are on the bull. They own it. So you want to stay clear of that. Stay clear of that. Because it's going to be a problem. You know what I mean? I mean, nobody wants the aggravation. And they're definitely there to aggravate your soul. Alright? So, get on my body here, man. Look at that mountain there. Look at that right there. Hold on, y'all. Wow. It's going to cut y'all off. Look at what we're coming into right here. Ah, you want to pull over right there. We're pulling these trailers. Wow. It never stops the stupidity. Look at that right there. I'm telling you, West Coast, man. Can we shake? Can we get some West Coast love? I got to get some more drone shots, y'all. I, I got to before I get out of here. I never really come across the dime. Coming down bottom. Uh, that's what I call it. Coming right down across the dime. It's running across the bottom of the United States. I call it down bottom. Sorry if you don't understand the term. No, so you're going to be all right. But man, isn't this beautiful here? Ugly mountains. They're not as nice as the other ones. But man, look at this. Some of those are covered by the. You can't even see. Look at that. Wow. Tell you, the West Coast is dope, man. Love the views in the West Coast, you know. We out of California. We can get ready to be out of California. Get on in Arizona. It's your boy, Party Hard. Y'all stay safe. Stay sucker free.